And we're back yet again. And I will probably not clip that out for the humor of it. We are back in the noob system with the hauler. We're going to exchange it for an adder. Don't glitch out your game. And if you do, if your buttons stop working, but when you push them, you hear menu selections moving around, but your screen is frozen, uh, don't freak out. Just exit back out to the main menu and come back in. It will fix it. Um, last video, I mentioned that there are bugs. Uh, that's one of them. It's not the only one, but dang it. Oh, yeah, I was going to show you that you can't. Um, I'm going to try to buy this ship. I can't. I can't exchange a ship. I'll click on it. Why can't I? You have too much cargo to move this ship. Move to this ship. This ship can only carry six tons, but you have 15 tons. So you have to back back out. That's why I said, oh, crap. Go to the commodities market and sell what's in your cargo hold. Um, some of these things, this is actually, you see over there in the red, I'm pointing, even though you can't see my finger. Um, it is 30 credits less than the galactic average. Um, that means that this is not the best place to sell it. But for the interest of time, I'm going to go ahead and sell it. This, I'm making a profit, which means it is higher than the galactic average. Uh, clothing here, also a profit. Algae. Oh, this is a considerable loss. Now, since all this is salvage, I'm not taking any loss. What it's telling me is it's I'm selling it at 290, 180, 310, or 240 less than the galactic average per ton. Meaning, I can find better prices for these. Okay. Um, if I am in this game for money, which you should be if you're playing this game. Um sell the green save the red take it somewhere else but for the interest of time in this video i'm going to go ahead and sell it for less than what it's worth i'm not now if i had bought it i would not be doing this but since this is salvage any money is, is profit anyway because i didn't pay for it this is just what i picked up extra from those missions but i can maximize my profit by selling it at the best cost which you should do. <laughs> and here's the adder. I'm going to exchange the ship. You can see that the cost of the new ship is 87,000. Um, the parts exchange, meaning my current ship, is 113,000, which means I'm going to get 25,000 back for trading in the ship. But I've got to fit that ship, so I'm probably going to spend that 25,000. Okay. Okay, now we have this, and we're going to go to outfitting. I'm going to leave those on there for your guys' sake. Hmm. This is eight, this is four, and six. That's going to be 20, I think. Hmm. I want it to hold 20, a minimum. Kind of have one of these. Got to buy an SRV. I don't know why it doesn't come equipped. 
Maybe sometime in the future there will be a selection. If there is, then the requirement for it to be equipped uh, makes sense. But until then, it doesn't. Um, I'm going to... Yes, I can buy a size 2 shield. So I'm going to buy a cargo rack for this. Um, the shield generator. Definitely want a shield. And we don't need that docking computer. Because I like to dock it myself. But I will buy the cargo rack to bring me up to 20 tons. Now, the difference between this and the hauler that I just had is I now have a shield. And I have this SRV so I can land on planets. Um, this here, I will do it just to show you. When you sell your planetary approach suite, you can only buy a planetary approach suite. So there's no point in selling it. All right. And check the missions board. Actually, we still have 91,000, so we didn't spend everything. Um, we'll take this mission. Um, these are my favorite missions to do. Um, I'm not going to do them because I may have to travel outside the baby bubble to get them. And if I were to do so, I probably wouldn't be able to get back because I have ranked up. I'm a peddler. I'm mostly aimless and I'm harmless. So, I'm not going to do that. Um, courier jobs are easy. They're boring, but they're easy. Uh, delivery, uh, 7 is 13 and 3. It's, I can only haul 20. So, maximize your profit. Um, 3 tons for 30,000. That's, that's going to be a good profit. Um, six tons for 30. That's not that great of a profit. Planetary scans. Uh, we'll take these. I'll show you how to do those. The fact that it goes back up to the top every time, it's annoying. Yes, that's a bug that's been in a game for a very long time. Um, it's not game breaking, so I don't think they're going to fix it. I'll grab this. We just did one of those. They're easy with decent money. I didn't put any weapons on this. I need to change that. Um, let's see. I want to maximize the profit. 6 for 21 or 6 for 33? I'll take 6 for 33. I have nine cargo. I can fit 11 more. Um, hmm. I think I need two more spaces. I have five spaces left, and this mission, yes, I need two spaces left. So I'm going to go into outfitting and get rid of that super cruise assist. And I'm going to put some hard points on this thing. Um, pulse lasers are good. They are good. Uh, there's nothing wrong with pulse lasers. I would suggest you start with gimbals. Mm. Hmm. Not going to be fitting it here. <laughs> I 
we'll switch these to gimbals just so you can see what they do. reason I'm putting weapons on this is because I'm hauling a lot of cargo for different missions, which means pirates may come after me. NPCs, as well as players, but you can't be interdicted in the noob system. You're safe from that, but you're not safe from NPCs. So, for now, the only thing I can do is grab a, a big one. Um, I don't like that. Hmm. <laughs> All right, we are fit. Let's uh, do our fire groups. So we, if we get interdicted, we can fight. There's that. All right. 